so today I have an Uga Villa and it has a lot of different ways to play, but I'm only going to show you two and this is one. Um, so I, I attached some stuff that, to my rubber bands and I can pull them up and then when I drop it, it makes a sound. into this part of my pick and then I do this when I I can only pluck one string and it vibrates all of them or I can do this oh and I, I can also do that I can do the same thing that um, but with one string like this I hope there's another time I can show you more of them because I need to get more of my work done. Can you play it just like that too? With your fingers? Yeah, I can, I can also... Uh, I can use it like a guitar. Or I can play it like a cello. Or like an upright bass. Nice. And so yeah, um, my materials are rubber bands, um, an old pan that my mom does not want anymore, and um, it, mm, it's some um, twisty ties. Twisty ties and. A little thing that I don't know. My mom just gave that it to goes me. on the bread bag. Oh, um, and and that's the Ugabella. Yeah, I um, I'm I'm gonna keep this and I'm gonna start playing it and write some songs. To, yeah, write some songs. And an interesting thing is the way it makes sound is so it it sounds like this. Can you hear it? Wait. Mm -hmm. And that's my fade sound and my other sound is on this side and this is my loud sound. And I had to cut this uh, one, this uh, rubber band in half, and put it through that because I needed one in the middle. And I tied it on the other side. And nice, yeah, very creative. <laughs> 